A Fargo woman is in the running to be on the cover of Inked Magazine, and the winning prize is $25,000. With the money, she hopes to give back to the groups that helped her find her mom, who went missing 30 years ago. Valley News team's Alex Larson sat down with the woman to learn more. I just want to give some hope to people that it can, you can bring them back. Crystal Anderson's mother, Mary Lynn Anderson, went missing over 30 years ago in Wyoming. I never did get to meet my mom. I have pictures of her um, together when I was little, but we never knew what happened to her. She never gave up trying to find the woman. She never got a chance to know. She entered her mom's information on sites that profile missing persons to get her name out there. We had a few situations where we'd seen some missing Jane Doe's and it sounded like, well, that could be my mom because yeah. that sounds like the area she was in the last time she was seen. When she called the sheriff's office where her mom had last been seen. But her information was completely wiped out. And then in 2016. The BCA showed up at our door and said that my mom had been um, buried as a Jane Doe in Gillette, Wyoming. Um, since 1983. Her family brought her mom's remains back home and laid her to rest. But the case investigating her death remains open. And so far, there are still no leads on what happened to her. She was buried in a gravel pit <clears throat> out there, and it was actually road workers that had found her remains, her skull and everything. So. Anderson entered a contest to hopefully bring awareness to those who are missing. If she wins the Inked Magazine competition, Anderson says she wants to give some of this prize money back to those who helped find her mom. I see so many of these organizations that are having problems running them because they don't have enough volunteers. They don't have enough money to keep the pages going for everything that they need. Because a lot of these people, this is what they do every day. She's even started a nonprofit of her own to help find missing persons. It's something that my mom would want me to do. You know, I just, I want families to have that help. Um, there wasn't much, you know, these kind of things back when my mom went missing. You never give up on them. If we would have given up, you know, it's been over 30 years, but it can happen. In Fargo, Alex Larson, Valley News Live. The competition ends in March and voting for Crystal is free. If you would like to vote for Crystal, we'll have a link attached to this story on our website.